You'll see. Yes? Hi. <laughs> oh. Hello. We're looking for Mr. Madrazzo. Patricia, for fuck's sake, just let him in. Right this way, gentlemen. <laughs> Patricia, get us something to drink, would you? Quickly! Hey, good to see you again, Michael. Shoot him down and get the files back. A man, what's a pay? <laughs> huh? Trevor, come on. You still want a drink? Not now! Pendeja! Que no ves que estoy hablando con las gentes aquí? All right, you grab a vehicle, something versatile. Oh, fuck. But I did kidnap his wife! Oh, no! Oh, shit! What the fuck did you do? Oh, I just told you what I just did. Now, oh, shit. Uh, unfortunately, I think that we're gonna have to lay low for a little while while, you know, we discuss things with Martin. Oh, you think? Why don't you hop in the back? All right, now, Patricia, she already called shotgun. <laughs> now, I know a nice oh, little shit. place we can hang out, you know? It's a, a very relaxing oh. little spot. A little getaway, if you will, a cabin in the woods. You know what I'm saying. Oh, hey. Trevor's got his wife. Trevor's got a wife? No, no, the Mexican's wife. What? <laughs> Shit, I don't know what to say about that one. Nothing. Nothing to say about that. Run! Run! I'm back! Coming, Trevor! Uh, bring me my coffee, I'm gonna cut your arm off. Absolutely! Who the hell's that, your maid? Oh, business partner. Good guy. Very loyal. Ron, Ron, that is Michael. And this is Patricia. <laughs> Listen, beautiful. You know, I'm sorry about everything that's happened. And, uh, you know, I can't guarantee no harm's gonna come to you. I might have to chop you up into little pieces before spraying your pulp mess down the drain, but I really hope it doesn't come to that. I appreciate your honesty. You are a good man. I can see that. You need your eyes examined, then. Ron, you miss me? Yeah, Trevor, a bit, I mean. How's the fucking business? I, I, I tried. If you're gonna give me a sob story, I'm gonna rip your fucking throat out and shove a turd down the hole. It's not a sob story. It's just not quite come good yet. But I heard about something to do with Merriweather. Mm, those assholes. Big yeah. cache of weapons they got coming in. So I thought you might want to, uh, requisition it. Fantastic. Let's go. I'm in. Whoa, no, 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 not you. Sit down. You're a wanted man. Stay low. And watch her, OK? She's a good lady. Let's go, Ron. Good to meet you, Michael. Fucking come on, let's go. Dad, listen, if you get this, can you give me a ring? Tell your mom, too, will ya? And Tracy, please, son. Your daddy's been a bad boy. Uh, please, son. <laughs> you want a sniff? The fuck is wrong with you? <gasps> oh. <laughs> now, see, the way I see it, this country was built by and for gasoline. So I'm just trying to prove my patriotic duty by, you know, doing this stuff. Oh, man. It's cheap. But it's good. Gasolina? No. <laughs> wow. Sorry, Mrs. M. Jesus. Mikey, you want a beer? Oh, shit, I'm sorry I don't have any low car. Oh, fuck you. Uh, where'd you two go when you went out, you and your boyfriend? Why do you care? I don't care. Just trying to conversate. Well, I was out putting some people in their place. Ah, you know, there's more to this gig than just going crazy all the time, killing everyone in sight. Just because I like the life and you feel guilty about it doesn't make you more of a man than me. And you know what? Deep down, I know you believe the bullshit, the picket fences, the fucking happy endings. And your street philosopher bullshit, that's gotten you real far. Oh, yeah, you've achieved perfect balance. Balance? <laughs> you've gone. Man, 10 years in the sun, your brain is melted. You, you say words that have no meaning. What is balance, huh? Huh? Did I fucking kill only on the weekends? 
So Monday, Wednesdays, and Fridays, I'm doing yoga and meditation. Tuesdays and Thursdays, hookers and sticking up joints, huh? You call me mad? Fuck, compared to you, I'm the sanest motherfucker I know. Oh, oh, yeah, sane, 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 oh, okay. sane. I am so fucking sane that I should open a fucking mental health clinic. <laughs> okay, yeah. Yeah, fuck, now you're gonna stop being an asshole? I don't know, but I'll try. Well, that, I like your honesty on. I uh, spoke to Franklin. Why? Unlike you, he hears that his homie's having trouble, right? And he has no problem coming to help. So you're ensuring that we lie low? Out here, by calling LS and inviting a known accomplice of ours you know to what? come out here, what, for a little visit? That is so fucking typical of you. So typical. You don't even ask about the trouble. You instantly think about yourself. You're right. I did do that. I apologize. It's not good enough. I'm leaving, huh? I might die. I hope you're happy. Right. Hey, I'm coming with you. No. Yes, I am. No. It's nothing else than to get out of this fucking dump. You're not going. Have fun, boys. Oh, I'm going. Make sure you don't Don't fuck stay it up. out too late. What monthly train? The monthly train. Where have you two been? Getting some fresh air. Talking of beautiful things. Yes, I hear Stockholm Syndrome is very nice this time of year. Well, hey, watch your mouth, boy, all right? I had a wonderful time, Trevor. But we both know I made a vow to my husband. <laughs> I know! You have a great pain inside you. But you are a beautiful man. I've never been so happy and so sad in my life. You have a beautiful way with words. <coughs> for, for, some, for some reason, everyone I love abandons me. I am not abandoning you. I am going home. If <laughs> you treat you. I know. I know. No. Stay. You better treat her right, man! I will, amigo! Yeah, otherwise... The other ear! Of course! Uh, the way I see things, you and me and Michael, we're, we're friends now. Uh, good friends! Such good friends that we will make a great effort to avoid one another! That's fucking perfect! Don't be afraid to uh, Thank Michael for the statue! It is exquisite! It. Yeah! Yeah, I will! <laughs> 